Hello and thanks for watching Local Edition, I'm Eric Wattilla. Farmers markets, they're often seen during the summer months, but they might not be the first thing you think of during the winter. One local market is still around during the winter months though, and they recently had some special exhibitors. Vic McCarty explains. It's a Saturday morning in Frankfurt, a snowy Saturday morning, and this is a farmer's market. But this particular Saturday recently was special. It was Fiber Artists Unleashed. In addition to the usual vendors, the market hosted local fiber artists. A lot of these crafts are traditionally something that you would think of that your grandparents brought over from Europe. Including this young lady who was spinning a little yarn. This device on the wheel, it's called a flyer. When it goes around, it adds twist to the fiber. And so it's when you take the fiber and add twist to it that it becomes yarn. Now at the risk of stating the obvious, these fiber artists are proud of what they do. And they're showing off the quality inherent in their work that sometimes goes unnoticed in a culture that gravitates to cheaper mass-produced products. Perhaps not here though. I think the community in this part of the state in general appreciates handmade items and uh, craftsmanship. In addition to fiber artists, there were vendors with good stuff to eat, like for example, root beer cookies. Rich, warm root beer cookies with root beer frosting and a glass of milk just knocks your socks off on a day like today. And fresh lettuce and rosemary all grow locally in greenhouses. And what they're just beginning to discover is by being able to keep the greenhouse up to 35 degrees, you can get a yield five times greater than letting it go down below freezing even though the plants are still alive. The farmers market in Frankfurt opened Saturdays 9 to 1 year round offering locally grown and produced products from around the region. In Frankfurt for Local Edition, Vic McCarty. Eric, now back to you. Thank you Vic. Coming up next on Local Edition, an art exhibit in Ludington is showing off the work of a Michigan author and illustrator. We'll bring you the details about this exhibit. That story is just ahead, so stay with us.